after training camp in Mexico this year, um, Jeremiah came back and knocked off a heck of a time right off the bat and put him number one in the country. Then he turned around and knocked off another great time, going 20.9, which is a heck of an accomplishment just off the Canadian record. The reward of that early uh, accomplishment was uh, making the Canadian team. He went to the Pan Am Championships in Costa Rica, made the final, um, came fifth, uh, which is an incredible, incredible accomplishment. Jeremiah feels he didn't really get to the level he wanted in that meet, but we went into the national champs this year, very focused, very driven. Went into the final, uh, ranked number one, and uh, everything came together. The Pan Am Games really kind of helps with your mindset a bit coming into nationals because uh, the level of skill at the Pan Am Games is generally a lot higher than the nationals here. It was a cool experience because uh, in Montreal, it's a fairly big city, so there's actually like crowds out there. And it was very cool to have uh, a whole crowd watching me get my gold and it was just, it was quite the experience, honestly. When Jeremiah first started working together, he was sixth in the province, which is only two years ago. Uh, he's ranked 24th in the world. From sixth in the province to 24th in the world, what he's accomplished is just, it's un unheard of. We have an Olympic potential athlete and we need to go to the drawing board and help him get to that level. We'll get him back in the weight room here in about a week, two weeks, let his body relax. Um, and then he'll go off to his university, which is Simon Fraser University in uh, Burnaby. They compete in the United States at a Division II level. Our next phase will be getting him ready for the Olympic trials next year. So for Jeremiah to uh, attend these major competitions and get more points, which will um, give him a greater value of earning on the national team, competing internationally, potentially the Olympics, um, he needs to travel. Uh, around a $3,000 figure for each competition. And you're looking at around eight competitions throughout the summer. We need to reach out to our community and ask for help. That is part of every athlete's dream, and uh, I do hope to make it. There's always the next Olympics if I don't make next year. So my dream is still to hopefully uh, go pro or just run for the Canadian national team or Haitian national team.